Hi, um, today what I want to do is look at this furnace and try and decide if the motor in the furnace is a high efficiency DC motor or a regular efficiency AC motor with a capacitor. I can see on the label of the furnace it's called a plus 90 furnace implying a 90% efficiency or a high efficiency furnace. Um, another way to tell that it's high efficiency are those two vent tubes uh, one provides combustion air and the other one provides exhaust air at a low temperature. So that's how I know it's a high efficiency furnace, but I don't know if the motor is high efficiency or not. Usually on these units, uh, it's not on these older. This one's from the 90s. So I'll just show you how to have a, have a look in here. The top panel just lifts out on most of these furnaces. So this isn't the motor we're interested in. This is the combustion air motor or blower motor for the furnace. Um, the, mower we're the motor we're interested in is in the lower section. Uh, but before we look at that, there is one thing in here. There's a specification sheet on the furnace that tells what size the furnace motor is. So I'm not sure if I can get a good picture of it. It's a one third of a horsepower it says on this label in here, right here. So we'll need to know that in order to determine what size of motor uh, we're going to replace it with. So this, on this furnace, the bottom panel just lifts out once the top panel's been removed. There's a safety switch here that uh, pops out when I take that cover off. That'll make sure the, the furnace can't run while we have the cover off. So in the bottom is a blower assembly. And inside the, the middle of the blower, it's a bit hard to see in the, in the picture. See if I can position my light in the camera. No, I don't think you can see it, but in in here is uh, the AC motors in the back here. It's hard to see, but hopefully what you can see is the capacitor with the blue label on. It's the capacitor right here. This blue label is, is part of the capacitor. This black cover, this wire looks uh, white in this light, but it's actually a chocolate brown. Two wires going to this capacitor. So because that capacitor is there, I know that this is an AC motor with a capacitor, and so um, I'll be able to gain some efficiency if I replace it with a DC motor. What I'm gonna have to do is pull this control panel out, uh, remove some of this uh, condensate drain and pull the whole motor uh, blower assembly back out of the furnace and um, that'll give me access to the motor which is on the right hand side of the blower assembly and I should be able to get a high efficiency DC replacement for this which will increase the furnace efficiency by maybe 40% or the electric part of it anyway. So uh, we'll look at doing that on another video.